It's with a heavy heart that I come to you guys tonight. And may our thoughts and prayers be with this family during this time. I am Sergeant Richard Bratz, the Director of the Public Information Office for the Delaware State Police, joined by Master Corporal Melissa Jaffe here to my left. The preliminary investigation has determined at approximately 8.07 p.m. the Delaware State Police patrol troopers were dispatched to this location for a death investigation. The Delaware State Police is working in conjunction with the Delaware Division of Forensic Science for further investigation. At this time, we are conducting the next of kin notifications and the Delaware State Police Homicide Unit is currently here conducting this investigation. More information will be available, or excuse me, more information will, you will be updated as it becomes available. At this time, that is the statement for today. I'm not taking any questions at this point. Every time he was here, he was playing with his kids. I mean, I don't know what happened inside the door, but I know he was outside with his kids a lot. On a warm summer day like today, neighbors say the Edwards home would usually be filled with laughter and giggles from the three children who would often play outside. Today, it sits eerily quiet, the toys outside strewn across the yard, the house now the scene of a horrific crime. Delaware State Police tell Action News the bodies of all five family members were found shot to death in the second floor of the home. They were 41-year-old Julie and 42-year-old Matthew Edwards along with their three children, 6-year-old Jacob, 4-year-old Brindley and 3-year-old Paxton. A longtime neighbor who wished to remain anonymous says he just talked to Matthew on Sunday and it was obvious there was trouble at home. Matthew had just lost one job, though he recently got another in Virginia, but that meant he was away for weeks on end. His marriage was in shambles, as were the family's finances. I was trying to console him, telling him that, um, you know, don't worry about your wife. You know, you can always find another wife or whatever, but think about your kids. Brian Kavenko and his wife often had play dates with the Edwards family. My wife and I are, are kind of in shock and really don't believe it. Um, just really uh, stunned and just, uh, kind of felt like something you see on TV, like Law and Order or a movie even. So it just doesn't seem real.